Good afternoon from the Log Cabin Restaurant. We're out here today in Hurricane Mills, Tennessee. Mom and Dad have told us all about this restaurant before. We've never been here before. This is an old log cabin over a hundred years old, I believe it is. It used to be a house turned into a restaurant. Look at there, it's calling our name right now. We cannot wait to get inside and get some great meat and three food. Oh yeah, we can't wait. It's about an hour and 20 minutes or so from the Nashville area where we live at. Uh, so not too bad of a drive, but it smells amazing out here. I wish y'all could just smell it right now. We're gonna head on inside and check this place out. Coming inside the log cabin restaurant, you are greeted with a beautiful log cabin. You got plenty of seating in here, plenty of space. It's just really nice in here. Okay, your husband called and said you can buy anything that you want. You check in right over here. And our table is back here in the back. There is the menu for the Law Cabin restaurant celebrating over 58 years. Look at there, there's some information about it right there. It's a Law Cabin that's over 100 years old. It was an old house here that's now been turned into a restaurant. There's the address, phone number, and everything right there since 1966. And over here, you got the Law Cabin sandwiches and the apps. They have some really good sounding apps there. The Bloomin' Onion, the deep fried green beans sound pretty interesting. And then over here you got the log cabin sandwiches. I don't think you can go wrong with any of these sandwiches over here. French dip sounds so good. We got a patty melt right there. Reuben, the chuck wagon. Oh, that sounds fantastic. You have your salads right here. They have a Cajun crispy chicken salad. And you have the soup of the day and soup and salad. And then over here you got the specialties and the country dinner plates. So we're on the specialty side there. I went with the pork chops today. And they got shrimp and grits, catfish, meatloaf, beef entrees. And then the country dinner plates, uh, Steph went with the chicken and dumplings there. What'd you get, Mom? Uh, Mom also went with the chicken and dumplings as well. And then Dad got the roast beef right there. But again, every option here, even the, the liver right there, you can't go wrong. All of it sounds great. Seafood, and on the back side, there's pastas right there. That chicken alfredo skillet sounds so good. And they got a Cajun chicken pasta. Uh, all your side items are here. And beverages down here as well. I don't see any desserts on here, but when you walk in, you see this pot has that huge meringue on it. So we'll definitely be getting us a dessert for sure. But the Log Cabin Restaurant. Food is on the way and we cannot wait. All right, we've heard some great things about the sweet tea here. It's also served in mason jars. You know, that's an A plus right there. Fantastic, perfect sweetness, made in house. You can't go wrong with that sweet tea. Plus the mason jar, it's a win-win all the way. Definitely recommend that. The food has a ride. I'll just show moms real quick. Mom got the chicken dumplings, the green beans, and the mac and cheese right there. And then a little bit closer to us is Steph. Steph's got the mashed potatoes with white gravy, mac and cheese, and those good looking chicken and dumplings. Me, I'm saving that for last. Look how good that looks. Dad got the roast beef and gravy. It looks really good. Okra and mac has a brown gravy. And then for me, I did the pork chops here. It has mac and cheese and okra with it. Those pork chops just look phenomenal. That's the bread, Dad. And then the bread here, you get to, everybody gets their own choice of bread. They just kind of put it into one basket here. So uh, Dad and I both got the Mexican cornbread, which is cornbread, spices, corn, and jalapeno. And then Mom and Steph both got the rolls right there. So we're about to start digging into our food. Oh, Stephanie's already digging into the food right here. Look at there. Stop, Stephanie. <laughs> oh, look at those pork chops, y'all. Already digging in, and food here is amazing. What do you think so far, Dad? Roast beef, great. Dumplings are good. It's just a good, good all around meal. Pork chop, everything's great. You know, we've been tasting everybody's food around here. So, macaroni and cheese. I'm gonna say it again, y'all. In the video I said in the past, it slaps. Cool. The okra here, fantastic okra. Pork chops, some of the best I ever have. It's got a unique kind of flavor to them. I love it. Dad's roast beef. Miss Berry Bobos is my favorite roast beef of all time. It's right up there with Miss Berry Bobos. It's, it's fantastic. This uh, Mexican cornbread, over the top great. Sweet tea's good. Uh, Stephanie's chicken and dumplings. Delicious. What do you Everything. Think about it? Well, while you're showing your food, what do you think, Stephanie? Oh, no, it's delicious. They're absolutely delicious. The chicken's huge chunks of chicken. Mashed potatoes, I got the white gravy. It's delicious. The macaroni and cheese is great. Yeah, good. everybody's food, we've all tried this. We all sampled it. I dare you to find a bad food here if you can. This is 
top quality, top notch. If it wasn't over like an hour and 20 minutes away, I'd be here every weekend. We'll go more in depth in the car when we get done, but this food is amazing. I know I have a big head, but let me tell you guys, the meringue is as big as my head. Look at this. Look at that. That meringue eye right there. Wow. Look how good that thing looks. I'm about to dig into that, but a ring as big as my head here. This is this is my style restaurant right here. This is good eating right now. And here's a better look without my head in the picture. But there is the meringue, that pie on the bottom looks, looks fantastic. Look at the back of that thing. It's just wow. Wow, 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 wow. That is how you do a chocolate meringue pie right there. This pie, one of the best I ever had. The only bad thing about it is there's none left. I got one little bite left. Or the DJ Khalid stuff, right? Another one? That's what I need to start doing. Just another, another one. one. Another yeah. one. I need more of these right here. I might get a second one. Just won't film it. So that was the Log Cabin Restaurant. Dad, what did you think over there? It was very good. Had great roast beef and uh, the vegetables were great. What was your favorite vegetable? Ve favorite vegetable? I like the mashed potatoes and gravy myself. That was really good, yeah. Huh? Okra was great. Yep. And Steph, what'd you think? Mine was really good. It had really big chunks of chicken and the, those dumplings. The dumplings were fantastic. Um, mashed potatoes were good. The white gravy was really good. What else did I have? Uh, macaroni and cheese. Macaroni cheese, really yeah. Good too. I yep. Like and mom loved hers as well. Mom absolutely said hers was great. Mm -hmm. And she'll definitely be back again. Chicken dumplings, green beans, and mac and cheese for mom. And, uh, Daddy, you ready to get some more food? Let's go. On the way out. On the way out. <laughs> and then I'm going to show real quick behind us. So this is right here in the Hurricane Mills area. Loretta Lynn's Ranch is where we are now. So in some of the past videos, you can see like the water flowing over. Absolutely beautiful. Not much water today. The whole crew left me, y'all. Everybody left me. <laughs> I'm not here by myself. Uh, we're right across the street from uh, Cole Miner's daughter in, uh, or Loretta Lynn's house. And um, I just thought it'd be cool to come up here and do our outro. We're not going to do all this today. In the future, we're going to come back here and we do a full video of Loretta Lens. Uh, but the price total was $55.26 for dinner. Uh, drinks were $3.19. Steps was $16.19. Uh, the pork chop dinner is $21.99. And the chocolate pie slice was $5. Um, so that was well worth the money. Uh, I tried everybody's food, and I absolutely loved everybody's. My mom's green beans are great. The mashed potatoes of brown gravy and white gravy are both fantastic. The roast beef was one of my favorite. I'm definitely going to come back and get that roast beef. It was so, so good. I'll show you a little bit of the water there. <clears throat> um, and the pork chop, I couldn't quite place like the glaze or the merity on the pork chop, but it was just fantastic, perfectly grilled, so good. The cornbread, the Mexican cornbread with the jalapenos and the corn in it, it was just fantastic. It was so good. Um, service was great. Uh, I love how they have tons of space in that area to sit at. There's plenty of room between the tables. Uh, it's just a good, good restaurant right off Interstate 40, uh, about an hour, hour and 20 minutes ish from Nashville. So not that far away. Um, definitely worth the drive. And um, the mac and cheese was great. Oh man, that mac and cheese was so good. The okra was fantastic. And so just everything was absolutely great. And look at that, that little meal back there. It was almost like Pigeon Forge. Just needs the big wheel right there, needs some water flowing over. but. You know, we'll definitely come out here in the future and do Loretta Lens and kind of do a whole video out here and show everything it has to offer. But it's just a beautiful, beautiful area out here. Uh, but with that being said, definitely check out Log Cabin Restaurant. I guarantee you, you will love it. Oh, and that pie. The meringue was so good. The crust, the chocolate. Whew, that thing was, I say slap sometimes. That thing was slapping. <laughs> That's the, the new words, right? Uh, for Not for us old people. Um, but man that place was so good so yeah just check out log cabin restaurant i guarantee you you can't find something you don't like there it's it was that good top notch it's definitely our time about it. it was like going to your mom's or your grandma's house and getting that home cooked meal that you love you're just like this is life eating the best food i can possibly eat it's that good it's like mom's home cooking or grandma's home cooking it's that good it's, it's that good so go to log cabin you'll love it but that being said the nerds are Stephanie usually says out, but my whole crew left me. Look, they just, I'm out here in the water by myself. But the nerds are out. <laughs>